Hey guys, it is November 9th, 2016, and I'm not normally gonna put stuff like this in the video, but since these are daily videos, like memories of my life every single day, I'm kind of speaking to myself in the future because I always, always like to think that I would like to come back and watch some of these um, later in life. And um, if you haven't been living in a deep forest with no internet, no, no connections to cell phones, which actually sounds kind of nice right now considering what's happened the past year, specifically the last couple months, the United States has elected a new United States president, and um, with that, I've seen a tremendous amount of people that are really pissed off and angry, and there are equally the same amount of people that are rejoicing and are super happy about the situation. And my opinion is that I'm just glad it's over and we have selected somebody, whether it be my, my selection or your selection, a selection has been made, so now we can hopefully move on and just come together as a nation together because right now we are separated and it's it's disgusting to me it's so disgusting to see and i just hope there's no gloating with the situation and we are able to just move on and um just come together because th here's the beauty in my opinion about the united states and a country we live in that even though we have this person who i don't believe in a lot of things he says or does i mean that's my opinion that you can have whatever opinion you want. We are able to sell, fight for the rights that we believe we should have. And it doesn't matter who is in office, we can still fight for those rights. And I think that's what we need to keep in mind and remember that just because the person that we may or may not want in, in, in office be there doesn't mean we should give up. It doesn't mean we should not fight for things we believe in because we all have that right. And for people who might be happy I just hope the gloating doesn't happen because that'll just make things worse. And I just, that's all I want to say. And Charles in the future, you're, you're looking kind of good. You're looking like John Stamos right now. <laughs> that's me hoping right there. Uh, yeah. Anyway, so that's all I'm going to say about that. And, um, let's just come together guys. Let's just, let's stop. There's enough hatred in the world. We don't need our country hating on each other. That's it. I mean, that's the best advice I could give to the situation because that's all the advice I could say is let's just move on. Let's just keep fighting for the things we believe in. What are you doing, old lady? Hanging out in your rocking chair? Come on, guys. Let's hop up. Go get some air. Come on, D. Okay. Well, it's just gonna go me. I'm just gonna go get some air. Oh, and Zoe. You gotta meet Mr. Puppy. Mr. Unnamed Puppy. Come on. Peyton. She's like, I'm busy. Peyton. Peyton. Look at it. What you got? Let me see those teeth. Let me see. Ooh. Which one did you lose? That one? Are any other ones loose? No? Only one. Cool. <laughs> oh yeah! obvious reasons it's just been a weird day like everything's been weird people like walking around the neighborhood like I went to the store everyone is just like I don't know what it is it's just got this weird and it doesn't help that the freaking sorry there we go I can never focus with this this is what I gotta deal with there we go oh, come on. what was I gonna say yeah Okay, forget it. It doesn't help that the weather is like freaking out too. Like it's super cold, it's so gloomy. It kind of feels like what it feels like what? What do you see? Do you see a squirrel? Oh, you see a, you see a pup? You gotta sit down, nobody. I know. We're gonna be good. I know. It's so funny, all three of them do the same thing. When they see another dog, they're just like, it's almost kind of like they're just like, 
yeah, look at me. I'm rolling. That's just the voice and the thought process that I put inside my dog's brains. What I'm saying is today's just been like a weird day. I got some things accomplished though, but I got stuck in the house pretty much the entire majority of the day. Got a couple things done that I needed to get. Not exactly the most interesting thing, but it doesn't really matter because that's what my daily videos are about. It's just life. I wanted to take this wall that's behind my dresser and do something a little bit different to it without it being like crazy, crazy dramatic. And if it ends up being a mistake, it's something that I can change. So I ended up getting that wallpaper stuff that looks like brick and it's textured and it's, I know it's fake and it's, most people are probably gonna be like, oh, it's really cheap, why would you do that? I decided to get it anyways and I'm gonna try it out and see if it actually I don't know, you know, kind of looks cool back there. And then if it does, we kind of want to do something on that wall. So I'm just going to go ahead and try it out. I don't know if it's going to work well. I've never done this before. So yeah, this is definitely going to be an experience, but we wanted to do a little something just to, I don't know, make the day different, I guess. Whoops. It's very heavy. So you're laying down some bricks? Mm -hmm. oh, how are you supposed to stick it? Is it supposed to be like... It's really oh, it's just like an adhesive? This is not as easy as it looks. I think you need four hands. You need help pushing this in right here. And then if I push it in like that, you can like... See, and it's not... I can kind of get it straight on this side. Yeah, you, you need somebody to push it in. Here, hold up. I gotta put the camera down. Hold on, we're gonna lay down some bricks in this house. I like it. It's kind of cool. It's different. Yeah. And we could try it here and see if it's any good. And then, because we're going to put this back where it is and see if that's any cool. Like, uh, any cool. <laughs> I've been stuck in front of a computer all day. My brain is fried. Okay, now it's going over too much on the wall. Oh, by the way, guys, uh, this is totally random. If you have not seen yesterday's video, here's a little glimpse. Okay, that's a teaser. Now you need to watch yesterday's video. Basically, my little sister got a new puppy and she needs some names. So go check it out and go give her some names because right now we're kind of like all over the place. I was, I was expecting Allie to make fun of me for that. It's just focused. But yeah, yeah, but seriously, she got a cute little puppy and she needs names. Since Vlogger Fair is coming up, I think this weekend. Yeah, it is this weekend. Is this this weekend? Here's the, here's the beauty about being a little bit of procrastinator. I didn't quite unpack everything from Bufferfest, so I can just literally just go like this. And I'm packed. Not quite. No, I'm packed. Literally everything is packed now. Uh-huh. I'm serious. I got, a, I got a couple hoodies, I got a couple big jackets, got several things of underwear, I got socks, I got shirts, I got shoes, I got an HDMI cable. I am packed. I won't ever do it again. That's for sure. It's kind of cool. Yeah, but I won't ever do that again. It makes it look like uh, very rural, industrial. very industrial, very. It's like somebody forgot to do our wall, basically. Yeah, it's not. I wouldn't recommend it. When you do it, when you go like that, it looks kind of cool. It looks real. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend it though. It's too much of a pain in the ass and it doesn't stick that well. That's nice. So more than likely you guys will see this down in like two months. <laughs> it might fall down in a couple days actually. It's too loud over there. 
I didn't know where Marley went. I think I know where she is. Hi, bud. Oh, yep. There she is. Hi. There you are, Mar. All right, guys. Watch this. I'm gonna go get a cookie. Marley, want a cookie? Pretty girl. Nice, sweetie. Well, internet, we are going to call it a night. I just wanted to kind of end tonight saying we as people in general need to still believe in one another and still hold on to hope and that we need to stick together and we need to support one another we do not need to do anything cruel or unkind. We need to continue working towards positivity when it comes to us as a group. Social media has been really bad today and uh, it's been really hard for me to hold back not saying anything. And I'm not saying it towards one group or another I'm just saying that it's terrifying to see what's been going on and I just don't want us as a group of amazing individuals. It doesn't matter where we come from. It doesn't matter our color, our background, our age, our sex, whether our families are wealthy or not. It doesn't matter. None of that matters. We are all one people and we need to support one another and we need to continue working towards positivity and love. I just know that from all the negativity that I've seen in the past couple of months and the negativity especially that I've seen today, I just don't want us to lose faith in each other. I don't want us to disregard what we've worked so hard for, which is being able to be exactly who we wanna be. All I'm going to encourage you and all Charles is going to encourage you to do is to please do not get lost in this negativeness that's going on right now. Please do not get lost. I know there's going to be a lot of negative in the comments and I know people are going to think that we're stupid and there's going to be people on both sides that are going to say things, but please find it in your heart to be human and to be kind and to look out for one another and to support one another and to not let all the negative that is going on right now determine the type of person that you can be, which is a good person. Hold on to hope, be there for one another, support your friends. Don't let the negativeness of social media right now and everywhere that are saying these awful things determine your choices of either being a good or a bad person. Lead by example and lead by example in a positive way. Please, that's all I ask. I'm just astonished at some of the things I'm reading on social media and I just, please guys, do not let this negativity get the best of you. We love you guys. We hope that you're having a wonderful day and you have a wonderful day tomorrow. And just remember spread, spread love guys. It all goes back to that spread love, positivity and hope. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye guys. <laughs>